Hey there, Prodigy Land. It's me, Coach Randy, coming to you from Loose Park in Kansas City, Missouri, where Oreo and I are taking it easy for a few seconds just to film this video and share with you a little something something. Of course, this place was covered with snow and ice about 48 hours ago and will be covered with snow again in about another hmm, 36 hours or so as another blast from the north is headed our way. But I just wanted to clean up a little unfinished business that I left unattended to, unaddressed, in our Farewell Atlanta episode of Prodigy Bowlers Tour before I left Atlanta. I'd been sent some videos by some of our young bowlers and their parents showcasing some of their exciting exploits on the bowling lanes, but I couldn't remember whose I had put up on YouTube and which ones I hadn't. And then I was reminded <laughs> after the video went up with the Farewell Atlanta episode. And you guys should hear about this. First of all, Bolin Nolan Kemp, a little while back, shot his first 300 game. Let's go! And then young Christopher Nathanson got Oh, tantalizingly close. I'm here bowling practice with my kids. My son has the front nine. Going for his 300. Come on, ball. Oh my God, there's 10 in a row. This highest game ever is 257, by the way. Come on, Bubba. I can't believe this. Needs two more strikes for 300. Oh, get lucky. Yes. Oh my God. Deep breath, bro, deep breath. One more. Front 11 for Christopher Cody Nathanson. 13 years old, bowling three years. Come on, ball. Oh. Wow. 299. So a near 300 for young Christopher. And then Hunter Moffat recently shot his first 300 game. And lo and behold, to start 2022, Hunter was out practicing on a day when they had the cosmic lights on at the bowling center. And look what he did. Come on. Yeah. Oh, 
his second 300 game. So congratulations to all these kids. And I got nothing else to share with you other than where, you, where are you, girlfriend? Well, there's a nice picture of Oreo's butt. I was hoping she would come over and say hello, but she's like the world's worst model when it comes to facing the camera. So anyway, hope you guys are staying safe. Happy New Year, and I'll talk to you later.